Around 9.15 Sunday morning, neighbors in the Russell neighborhood woke up to crime scene tape and police cars outside their homes after a man was shot and killed near 29th and Cedar Streets. I'm fed up. Uh, when someone takes uh, a life away, it, it's, it's, it's heartbreaking. People who live nearby say while they didn't know the victim, it's devastating to learn another life has been lost to gun violence. So many people are losing their life without getting a chance at life. And that's what's so it's, it's painful. For me, it was another person that um, probably lost their life to something senseless. Um, another family that, you know, has to go through hurt and pain. Officers say when they got near this intersection, they found a man who had been shot multiple times. He died at the scene. We have to improve more on what we do uh, to make an impact in this community to see that violence isn't the way, that's not the answer. And as police continue to investigate, neighbors are hoping the victim's family finds comfort as they grieve. When you put it in God's hands that he can handle and, and fight the battle more than you can. They say the community must do more to find solutions to the violence plaguing the metro. We just need to come together, you know, and to reach the city and, and be that voice of hope. Jamie Mays, WLKY News.